Maisie is making, what are you making? Sauerkraut. Sauerkraut. She put a little salt in about four pounds of cabbage, and she's smashing it out oh, right two now. Two tablespoons of salt. Hmm? Two tablespoons of salt. Can I have your face a little bit? I'm look not at, showing look, your... Look at my hair. You look beautiful. Look, no, don't tell me that now. Look at my hair. You, no, I'll, I'll doctor it up in the post-production. How's that sound? So while this is going on, you got pudding in the in the oven, right? And it's carrot and beet pudding. Is that what it is? Yeah. Carrot and beet. So I don't know what I'm talking about. Huh? So you look you look that one. It's only for the other one. Nothing at all going on. Nothing. Nothing goes on. What are you saying? I don't no, understand. I'm saying. If it was fine, you are alone. Nothing will be going on oh, here. Oh, boy, I'm going to have to cut this out of the video. Yes. You know, <laughs> you, 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 you only want me doing something. Eh? You, you can talk about what you don't. Okay. You are not productive in any way. Yeah. Okay, well, go ahead. You got the you got the camera now. I, go ahead. I don't want... <laughs> uh, okay, well, I'm a cameraman. That's my job, is being a cameraman. You don't know that? All this so crowd is funny. Eh? All this so crowd. You know, that's true. Now, <clears throat> Maisie likes to put an apple in this for flavor. Isn't that right, sweetie? But you eat off all the apples. I ate off all the apples. But, you know, before I even, before I even touch the apples, I want you all to know that Maisie pointed out to me that there were apples in the refrigerator. So... I ate the apples. That's what I do. Uh, if you would, if she would have told me to keep one back, I would have. And if a man came down the road right now selling apples, I'd buy her one. But it's too late now. So hopefully it'll taste okay without an apple. I don't know what. Of course it's okay. It'll taste just fine. Yeah. I might like it better. I might start eating all the apples every time now. Never save one back. You yeah, know, I should buy a bag of apple in Price Mart because it will be cheaper. Mm -hmm. I was to buy it and I didn't remember. I didn't remember. You didn't remember. So yeah, it's not my fault for eating them. It's your fault for not remembering. No, but. <laughs> no. Yeah. It was no? four apple I used one in the salad and I eat two. Okay. Well, it's going to be a nice video. Here, show me the juice. Show me the juice that's forming. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You just keep doing it till it just. This one can stop, man. So oh, stop. and then you and you yes, just. This is a lot of juice. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you'll have to explain how you make it in for sauerkraut. What what the next step is and everything. Then don't you don't don't you should be able to. But I remember. I forgot. So quick. Of course. You don't know what kind of memory I have. I was going to put it in and set it for maybe. Two days. Two days without the yeah. lid tight. Yeah, yeah, Just yeah, because it's gonna ferment. Oh, okay. I need to fix. Uh, so you leave it about two days with the ferment. Uh, well, no, we're ferment. gonna test it too. We're gonna test it because we want it to reach. Oh, uh, uh, we want it to. You got it. We got. Like, we use our pH meter. The pH, and we want it to reach like maybe four point three or something like that. Four point three. We want it to go higher than seven. Four point seven. But it could be like 3.9. Well, the, yeah, the, the lower the number, the more acid. Yeah, it could be 3.9 if you want it at that hour. I think 4.3. I think the one we really liked was 4.3, the one we liked the most. Yeah. I'll make a cow in the bottle. Hmm? Oh. You wonder if you can what? Pull in that bottle on the table. Oh, it may be too much. May have to use two bottles? Hmm? I have one bottle and two oil. Mm-hmm.
then you squish it down once you get inside the the jar too, don't you? Mm -hmm. Compact it some more. Yeah. That's how you make sauerkraut. It's really good, and we like it on our salad. It's one of our favorite ways to have it. Or sometimes we'll have hot dogs, and I love it on my hot dogs. Or just if I need a little snack, it, and it just really is. I like it. I just like it. It's way different than if you just buy the store bought, unless you're buying the store bought that's made the same way. Because this is the natural way to make it. It's used with the fermentation. But this homemade is going to be full of probiotics. Because that one, you remember, they um, have to go on the shelf. In the mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. This has to be refrigerated so, once it's done. Mm -hmm. it, otherwise, it'll keep fermenting and I don't know what happens then. It will explode the bottle. Well, no, but you can't. You won't have to lock it up. What? No, no, it I mean in the grocery soft. store. In the grocery store. Yeah, yeah, yes. You could, yes, you, yes. No, it could. When you buy it in the grocery store for fermented this way, you'll find it in the refrigerator section. Yes. It will be more expensive to get those. Uh, uh -huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Fit in there perfect. Just like my big head of cabbage. I love cannola. Yeah. Okay. Well, just so everybody knows, after <clears throat> after a couple days, this will, bubble, this will get bubbles in it. Actually, get bubbles in it pretty quick. And then after a couple days, we'll test the pH. This is what we do. This is not really a traditional Jamaican. Uh, something that we're doing so here. This is um, a German, German or something. That's why the German. kraut, the the name. Yeah, that's the uh, also. But look at the moisture in that. Look yeah. at the moisture. Mm hmm Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, there we go. Anyway, then you take a couple of the leaves the old and put them on top leaves. because you. This needs to be. Hopefully. Under the juice, it has to be covered, otherwise it won't <coughs> it won't ferment right. So you take the leaves and push them down around the edges, so it keeps everything submerged. But look at the amount of water. Look at yeah, look at the amount of water that. And <coughs> how much salt did you put in this? Four pounds of cabbage. Two tablespoons. Two tablespoons. Is it any kind of special salt or just regular? You have to use sea salt and not iodized. You can't use oh, you can't use iodized. It will not work. Okay. It will not ferment. Okay. If you, if you use the iodine. If the salt with the iodine or anything, or anything that they, um, they put something to in the salt to prevent it from caking. Up. From caking? The, ca yeah. the anti-caking. So you have to use the right kind of the sea pure salt. Kind of the salt. pure sea salt. This. And then you tighten it. And the course, I think. Well, you can't leave it tight. Or do you leave Not it tight? Sure. Um, you can't leave it tight for the day, man. But for the day? Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. What? You know what? To, uh, I'm going to put a plastic over mm -hmm. there. I'm going to the salt. Yeah. Okay. The lid. And just kind of put it just snug. That way the... Air pressure can come over there, okay? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. There we go. We did all our sauerkraut, and Maisie's got it set to ferment. But you want to be sure and like, share, subscribe, comment. Let us know what you think of this new format that we're using. Red Button Journal.